Hi, my name is Bill Bradley. I'm an extreme endurance athlete. The topic of today's video is know your priorities. I have three really big, really challenging events coming up. These are some of the toughest events in the world. At the end of December, I'm taking on the Tuscobia 160 mile run in northern Wisconsin where you pair a, a pull a 40 pound sled with your survival gear. One month later, at the end of January, I'm taking on the Arrowhead 135 mile run, which has been rated one of the 50 toughest runs in the world. I've tried Arrowhead six times, got my ass kicked six times, have yet to finish. You also pull a 40 pound sled with your survival gear. It's been as low as minus 48 degrees on the trail when I've been out there. Then if that isn't good enough, I go down to South America two weeks later, February 12th, I'm supposed to arrive at Mount Aguancagua in South America. One of the seven summits, the highest summit in South America, 22,000 feet high, highest summit in the Western Hemisphere. You think I need to know my priorities for my training? Yes, I do. So my priorities are, I got three big priorities right now that I need to stick to. My number one priority is I need to train. Physically, I need to train. I'm not gonna miss my training for nothing. Second priority is I gotta, that's physical training. Second priority is I gotta work my mental training. Have to 100% work my mental training because where your mind goes, the body will follow. And number three is my eating. I need to lose 20 more pounds to get down to my running weight, which is like really, really important when I have cutoffs and climbing mountains. Gravity and, and carrying an extra 20 pounds, just you know, imagine one of those weights at the gym uh, and throwing that on your back because that's basically what you're doing and say, okay, go run. Yeah, it doesn't matter if it's muscle or fat, it doesn't matter, it's gotta come off. So I have, those are my three priorities. So I always ask myself, I'm sitting around, sitting around and I'm not focused. I say, okay, what are my priorities? Okay, have I got my physical training in today? Have I got it in? Did I do my stretching? Did I do yoga? Did I go to weightlifting? Did I get my run? Did I get my hike in? Did I get my physical training? Did I do my weightlifting? Did I get my physical training in? Is there anything more I can do? And make sure I got that off my checklist. Then I say, okay, have I done my mental, my mental, my mental training? So I have like, I listen to probably almost as much YouTube videos per hour. Like I'm, do, I'm doing about three hours physical training a day, a, a day right now. And I'm probably doing about three hours of mental training on YouTube. All positive stuff going into my mind. I do affirmations. I'm doing all kinds of affirmations into my head. Just positive confidence, building my confidence, getting that all into my subconscious mind. Because 97% of what you do, or I think it's like 95 to 97, is there is from your subconscious mind. So you want that subconscious mind to believe that you can summit. Mount Aguancagua, that you can finish Arrowhead, that you can finish Tuscobia. You want that thing so tough and so mentally. All I do is I, I watch videos over and over again, positive videos. Champions, what champions say, what their mindset is as they're, as they're taking on their events. And so I keep putting that mental stuff. I got, I got about three hours of the mental stuff. I read goals, I read my goals morning and night into the, into the mirror. I listen to half hour of these affirmations right when I wake up first thing in the morning to get me in the right mindset and then I listen to a half hour more right before I go to bed at night so that's what playing in my head all night and not some problem I had that day and then eating I have a I have an 1800 calorie goal uh, per day that I'm sticking with and then I have one binge day a week that is going to carry me right down to that's my maximum I eat that's going to carry me down and get two pounds off a week and get me down to 185 which is my running weight which is my fighting weight which is my climbing weight which is my kick-ass weight so that's anyway so you see what my priorities physical physical training mental training and then eating properly 
So I always ask myself, okay, am I on this? And you might want to write up a little list and just kind of tape it all over the place. Did I get my, did I get my physical training in? Did I get my mental training in? Did I get, did I, am I, am I eating and fueling my body properly today? Anyway, get your priorities straight and you'll kick ass. If you're interested in contact me, you can email me at epicbillbradley at gmail.com. Thank you very much.